everybody. Uh, I'm Maurice. I'm Free. And this is MVE Reacts. We're about to react to Pop Cocaine DDLG. Like, what really bothered me the most, honestly, about the whole thing, I could do everything. It's like, she's so off key, bro. It's crazy. Like, yeah, if they all are doing the right, I'd be like, all right, whatever. Like, I knew how old a girl was, you can't be, I wouldn't be tripping, but you can shout out on Yuggy Jane, and she. Like the beat sound like some typical stuff you would hear. I'm like, the beat cool, like, that's whatever. But I feel like I have heard this, like, like, uh, yeah. like melody before. I mean, because she said she caught with some lullaby, so it's like, yeah, it's definitely like, at least in the same tier or something. It's like, yeah, this is emojis. That teapot shit, like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, they caught me the lullaby, but it's like. Why does she sound like that? That's my own thing. That's my own thing. She's on some big nostalgia type shit. Like, that's so, You can't be sound, bro. And I would be, be tripping. I mean, overall, the, I don't like the song, I guess. This is what it is. But the, the video. I guess the video, I like it. You know, there's a lot of ass in the video. So I wasn't tripping about that. Oh, the song is just out of how old shawty is, bro. Yeah, that's that was yeah. definitely troublesome for me. Like when I first <laughs> came on, like bro, like if she is like eighteen, she is eighteen. Yeah, like yeah, she fact. just hit that. Just, like definitely. I don't know, maybe I'm just like sure. just like like I'm looking at the whole time, like bro, what do in the industry like you really invested in this? This to, shit like, is funny, bro. I never heard of this girl. Bro. That's what I'm saying. Like never heard of like, four million, bro. She. I guess. And what do bro? What do DDLG stand for? Like I didn't even get the acronym out of the song. Like I'm not even sure. But I call like two bars. But that's what I'm saying. Like as far as like she just hollering the whole time and bleeding with the melody. Yeah, like, no like, like that shit was crazy. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck do the DDLG stand for. Yeah, that's that's plausible. And I should get the pop cocaine from. So, you a music producer? So, what is your like music? taste as far as this like i said the beat like it's cool like i don't have no issues with the necessary the beat it sound like i mean i can hear the baby on that. i can hear like a lot of people on yeah. that beat like there's nothing wrong with that and like even what she did i can't really judge it no different than like a city girl like he said magda stallion mm. my critique with her specifically was like i think the video and how they tried to like make it appear like you are completely lost as to what any of them acronyms like me, like for real, for real, based off the video, and there's not really much going on with the video. You just like dived into like, like the women in it. You know what I'm saying? Or if you coming yeah. to watch it, you watching it like us, like bro, what the fuck is going on? So from that aspect, and then I think another thing, like I was saying, was like the harmony. Like she just is like way, way too high for like the yeah, beat for that song, bro. Yeah. Like for the for the content of the song, like she coming. 13 talking 30, like that shit just sound crazy. There like, you go. The like, mix is crazy to me. Like, 
That thing is just too much. Know, her being got, so high, she came down. Like if she was yeah. in the Magda Stallion range, even I'm cool. Cardi B, I'm cool. That whole song, rocking. Yeah, I'm cool. Issues. I'll fuck her with it. So I don't know. I think oh, a lot man. of the views on it was like more of like on like on some like reaction or trying to like critique it, kind of sort of like you know. I don't know though, but cause she got. 119k subscribers, so like she got a little following. But every songs. other video like that or something like yeah, that, this niggas like, gonna keep. Yeah, yeah that's they it. Gonna just tune in and see. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And it's like yeah, the no. way she talking, it's like, bro, I think we just hit the iceberg for real. For yeah, real for that one, like, yeah, no like, cap, like, cause that's what 2020 July. Like, that's what I'm saying we got like and her years shit. of Nori's music and months of and shit I'm, like, heard. I'm just going off the video that's popping up now. Like the videos look like they damn near the same. Like. As far as how, like, what she going for. I mean, from, have you heard, you heard of her before? I was introduced to her, and when I seen the video, I was like, hell no. I, I, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> yeah, because, yeah, like, I mean, she remind me, like, if, like, Doja Cat chose to, like, really rap, rap. Like, you feel me? Or, like, go to, like, that type of lane and shit. Mm-hmm. Instead of staying with, like, a little, like, poppy way. Yeah. Like, that's how I feel to me. Even looking at she got the whole pink, like, kind of yeah. aesthetic. Yeah, she, she like, do different, little, like... She got a little Doja Cat vibe. Yeah, sure. like, like cartoonish, like, yeah. animated, kind of, like, personality yeah, about it. I can see that. I think in the right hands, the right context, you could do a lot more with it. Especially if she leaning into it like that. Like, but, uh, I definitely can see that. Yeah. Right. So, even, how do y'all feel about, like, female rappers, like, just dominating right now? I mean, shit, I like it. I, I'm not, I mean, I'm not mad at it, I should say. Like, you know, Meg Stallion doing her thing, City Girls doing their thing. Yeah. Shit, Nicki Minaj just jumped on the whole lot of Choppers uh, remix with Sada. I ain't mad at it. You yeah. feel me? I like that little perspective. So you about to do my dance. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, shit, I mean, they doing their thing. I ain't, I ain't mad at it, bro. Y'all go ahead, go crazy. Yeah, for me, I don't got no issue with the female rappers either. Of course, like, I think they all doing dope shit. And I don't. Give a fuck about it, nothing like that. Like, you know, I ain't yeah, never yeah. fuck with them. Like, they ain't never, like, got in my way. So it's like, I hope everybody just went and eat in this music game. One thing yeah. I still do notice, though, is like, it is like a weird kind of dynamic. Like, I noticed the gap between female rappers and like male rappers getting smaller. But however, with all the people named, like, below, unfortunately, like, if this one male rapper come out with that song, it's gonna, like, outweigh, like, all of them, like, that. You feel me? So it's like, I still see like certain issues where they got to work twice as hard and it is still sexuality at the forefront. Cause to me, right. ain't none of them rapping better than Rhapsody. But in order to hear her, unfortunately, it's like you got to get like a feature and stuff like that. Like obviously yeah. her album was hard, but to see her as dominant as you would like to, to mm-hmm. say she got the bars yeah, right and up. stuff like that. Like that's the type of like shit that I want to see at least. I don't want to say I want to see her more than Meg Thee Stallion because I can't say what's part of me, what's sellable. But mm-hmm. what I would like to see is that it's a closer competition right. where I can see it's a value in both, so, you know, for what they both talking about. Because I don't think there's anything wrong with what either one is talking about. It's yeah. just a lane for it. It's a, it's a content thing. Like, you was just saying, like, with Rhapsody, her shit more, like, thought-provoking or whatever. And, like, I know, like, Megan Thee Stallion and City Girls, Dream Doll, them type of... The way they rapping, they... They more explicit with it, so it's like, and that's just the sound right now for like the female rap. I guess it's like a little bit more of a mainstream sound. And Rhapsody, like you were saying, you really you want to hear her off of hers. You feel me? You gotta tap in with a feature and hear her, then you might go look at her other her other work. Like it's probably people that ain't even heard of Rhapsody, but yeah, she dope. Shout out Rhapsody, definitely. <laughs> but yeah, like that's how I feel about that. And I think even with the, I think with COVID too, that changed a lot with music for real, for real. Like just the approach that people are having and then even the momentum that you yeah. see like in hip hop right now. Like yeah. I think a lot of these dudes, what made them successful was they present. So it's like they always yeah. had some type of in your face kind of engagement and now it's way more critical of the music. Yeah, exactly, cause they're like, not seeing you and shit. Yeah, yeah like bro, yeah. Mario just dropped something yesterday. Mario Mario? Yeah, like, Mario Mario, like that jump is fire. Like, and I listened to it on my like, and you wasn't hip, you wasn't expecting it. But when you think like, about songwriting, like music, yeah. it's like, hey, bro, he is up there. And he it's up like, there for sure, yeah. But if you try and like compare that to like, let's say for like Boozy being out here kicking and doing everything, like they not really out here on the same, the same type level. Yeah. Exactly. So Boozy on the ground. You feel me? Doing everything. I give you a thousand dollars, show me titty, whatever. You feel me? Saying, Boozy bro. on that type of level. So you know, Mario ain't doing that. So exactly. Yeah. But so like now it's a lane to where like I'm starting to see these different. 
people come down to like the same level they starting to meet each other and that's that's interesting to see what's going to happen after COVID. Really, yeah, really. definitely. Definitely. Any closing thoughts? Uh, like I said, oh girl, the way everything was, I just didn't like the sound of the shit. Like the, the video was cool. I guess uh, the lyrics was cool. It's just the way she came on there. Like you can't come on there t- like sounding like you 13. That's my whole thing. Like you just sound young as hell. Like on some, yeah. you sound like on some Mario shit. Like you a little Mario character. So that was my whole thing with it. But it's cool. It's cool. That's what we all uh-huh. like. My final thoughts, like I, I do agree with that. Uh, I guess the dude who recorded that, he filed for that, uh, cause he 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 know he could have he could have turned down, you know, a little bit. He could have cut some of that high end. Now you know what I'm talking about, dog. Like you could have did that to that girl to help her out. But overall, like he said, it's I don't think from a lyrical context, but I wasn't expecting method man or bars, bars, yeah. bars, bars, yeah. bars. Like, you know, yeah. I think it was like a harmony thing, especially if you basing it around a lullaby. How you gonna knock, how you not even harmonize with lullaby? It don't make sense. So that's it for me. Like if I had to rate it, I'd do like a four or five. And I think that's generous. Out of ten? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like I think that's generous. Yeah, I'd say about a solid five. Solid five, but I also feel like she not making music to be like on no, like you said, on no method man shit. She nah. just doing it, just doing it. Like, she making music for engagement, for sure. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So I mean, shit. She, you know, she getting what she want out of it. Takashi approach. Yeah, it, it, exactly. <laughs> so it. shit, I ain't mad at it. Get your money. Yeah, hey, do your thing. Where can they find y'all on social media? Instagram two underscore the MDJ. Oh uh, yeah, you can find me on all social media at Produce uh, by Free. P R O D B Y free. Well, you have just seen a MV reacts to Pop Kane DLG. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next week. Mm-hmm.